Oh yeah. Let's Hell get yeah. into this then. I'll tell you what, Bobby. <laughs> Where's my DP twenty eight? Uh, <laughs> it's in the it's in the holding bay of uh, Her Majesty's Customs. <laughs> <laughs> not allowed. Rodina tried to give me one, but uh, it's not allowed here in the UK. Can't have a uh, full auto stuff. I could maybe have a shotgun if I acted like a farmer enough. <laughs> uh, I don't think you can pass it off, mate. <laughs> I don't think farmer suits you. <laughs> in Asia, you can it's if you if you go dash. with the hat with the hat, you can. In Asia, just go into our rice field with the hat, and everyone will buy it. <laughs> yeah. In England, I don't think so. Yeah, just give me some black pajamas and an AK, and I'm yeah, I'm set. <laughs> but no, I think um, uh, yeah, I'm just yeah, I'm definitely ready as you, as you asked. <laughs> but I kind of uh, kind of want to see something from Kimbo. It's like show me something, bro. You know you. you you're losing here. You gotta come back with something. I know he's against like god tier player in Asia Mint, but I I just don't want to see him win parade. You know, with like a three I mean, one. I felt like in game two, Asia Mint uh, got the uh, knocked out on the floor. Uh, the, he got his three count, but in game three, he just stood back up and came swinging out of the corner and just smacked mm. Kimbo in the face. <laughs> so uh, yeah. let's see whether Kimbo can bring it back. In game number four, ladies and gentlemen, the finals of the Vanilla Flash tournament. We're up for game number four. Score is two to one for Asia Min. And we're on Emily Fields. Kimbo is bringing his Soviets out. And on the southern side, we got... Oh, south side is big bad Asia Min. You know, he's got a lot of kitties as his profile picture. And he'll <laughs> definitely claw you to pieces if you let him. And he's locked in his famed OKW. He wants Vet 5 on all his troops. And uh, decimate these Soviet bliats in the north. <laughs> so we we saw in the last game some risky retreat paths and one tap ability of the T-34s. Do you think uh, Asia Mint can overcome that? The Soviet might, uh, Stanley, in this one? Oh, if one person can, definitely Asia Mint. Uh, I'm curious to see whether he's going for tried and tested flak halfback. Black half track plays, uh, play style once again, or whether he is going for mechanized this time around. It's mechanized, of course, has access to the Puma, and the Puma might just be the thing of choice to deal with the T70. And if you don't find a way to deal with the T70, then the T70 is just gonna. It's, it's, it's such a strong powerhouse for Soviets. It's a game changer indeed, and it comes out at like worryingly early time sometimes so we'll see how they can uh, maximize the timing with good fuel control hopefully for Kimbo and uh, to make you know the Brits always favor I'm British and we always favor the underdogs so I'd like to see it go to game five so I'll be I mean, silently uh, rooting for Kimbo yeah. <laughs> me as a caster we already had three amazing games in a best of three earlier this morning uh, and now we're doing a best of five Oh, of course, I want to see a fifth game as well. So Yeah, you've got your work cut out for you today. It's definitely been hard-earned. <laughs> oh, Asia Mint doing his famous hide-and-seek once again. Finds the engineers of Kimbo. Kimbo being forced off the field Same immediately. Bush. Same bush as last time, right? Yeah. It yeah. was yeah. yesterday. Yeah. An elephant never forgets, but uh, Kimbo maybe just... Yeah, didn't probably expect it this time as well. <laughs> Mind games, 1-0 for Asia Mint. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Morale plus 30% for all surrounding troops. <laughs> that was a good ambush. It, you know, if it works, it works. Don't, don't try and fix it if it ain't broke. But uh, we, we're getting asked where's Loveness, but um, reports we just in from High Command in Germany that he's in an all-inclusive cruise to the moon. <laughs> he's short on cheese and... Uh, Stone panzing his way to get some Kaiser from the moon, so it'll, it'll take him a take him a while to get back into our orbit. But um, he's doing very well. Uh, we did see a stream from him via the NASA satellite uh, a few weeks ago, so I'm sure he'll come back to collect his uh, annual fee of Kotu Tawny money in the World Championship later, or maybe potentially a bit of Master League actions. But uh, but here we got the finest. Kimbo against Asian. These are the best two players on current form at the moment. And they've proven it time and again throughout the last uh, couple of days here. 
Nice little bit of merge being acquired here uh, by Kimbo, keeping his flamethrower on the field. Needs to merge once again and manages to pull it off. Burning Fox Grenadiers back to base. As as they One like HP to shout. between four mods <laughs> yeah. sharing the same uh, lifeblood. This is gonna get a bit scared, Dicey. Oh, and on the retreat path, oh. we missed it. Storm Pioneers go down. Um, Kimbo with his sick wipe. Oh. Well played. And Kimbo keeps the flame alive. Double win there. It is basically Vet 2 already, four minutes in on the flamer. Laying down the cheeky trip flare mine. This is yeah. this is expert oh, yeah. stuff here for expert Kimbo. Stuff, Flying yeah. start for him. Like, North side OP, Kappa. Question uh, question answered, he is coming back swinging. Yeah, definitely. Good stuff. But this flamethrower, eh? have you ever seen stuff being held uh, together by duct tape? I think this flamethrower uh, squad is being held together by a couple of bandages. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There's nothing left. <laughs> Limbs Duck hanging off. Way to victory. <laughs> <laughs> a few twigs. Yeah, it's make do in Amelie Fields. But a uh, good pressure here from Kimbo. He's got the cutoff. He's almost. Yeah, he's OKWing the OKW player. And uh, by forcing so much pressure around the cutoff of Asian and wiping those stems means there's uh, very little risk of a counter attack by the Korean Master Lord at the moment. Let's yeah. see if all, all your base will belong to him <laughs> by the end of the game. Fresh conscripts coming up, but there's something cooking in the build for Asian That might have to say a thing or two towards these conscripts. Black half truck is coming up. Incendio grenades being used by Asian That's, a, I think, a huge difference between uh, Kimbo and Asian Asian uses incendio grenades whatever it can, or Kimbo prioritizes the SDG mm. upgrade. There's nothing more painful than lobbing an incendiary nade and the, the squad's already gone and you're <laughs> like, ah, that's Black half an SD. Just throw it away. <laughs> but uh, without any stern piles on the field for the foreseeable near future, it's going to have to do it the old fashioned way with car 98Ks. But uh, Flak Half Trap might help along with that. Yeah, there's no way for Kimbo to damage his Flak Half Trap yet. It's been happening reinforcing. Uh, what his. Uh, Medics and base upgraded as well. Is no AT needs an AT gun. No, no AT this is gun and the... Wow. Ugh. This map. Oh, double fire flare. Fire flare. <laughs> no sweep of pain, man. Oh, add a lot of vision now for Kimbo. So yeah. he sees, knows what's sees coming. And this building, uh, of course, is this gun as we speak. Yeah, smart move. He's not going for the AT nades tech first. He's making sure he's got a bit of a powerhouse of this gun. Might get some wipes with this as well, as well, you never know. I just love and, it. Uh, Asia Mint doesn't want to lose any more manpower and this sweeping floor with this flag off track. Back rounding, yeah. left, right and center. Preemptive play there. Good stuff from him. Just his presence of mind all the time. He's, he's like, he's, he's second guessing your tricks and your little baits so well. How do you outfox him? That uh, support package immediately upgraded here. Storm Pioneer. Yep, good uh, good cutoff attempt as well from Asia Mid, but nope. Slip around the outside of that capture Just point. Just been setting up. Off. Oh, it doesn't connect. First shot hits the tree. Wow, is this gun impersonating a, a rocket in there? Yeah. Don't know what's up. Saw that it's targeting systems. But yeah, Storm Pioneer's now back out can help uh, get some much needed presence back on the map for um, Asia Mimp. He's managed to consolidate nearly half of the map with, uh, without the fuel. But uh, in change, cut off a bit of Kimbo's fuel for a while. Just been reconnected, 33 fuel now. A minute for Kimbo. This could be world's fastest T-34 <laughs> rush, it's should yeah. he choose it. It's like, do you really need to do T70 every game? Could you swag with an 11-minute T34, you know? Well, Asian is definitely worried about the T70. Doesn't really know how good uh, Kimbo's uh, manpower is. But he opted for the Raketen instead of for the port uh, Oxford here, which he usually does. 18-8 going off here. Oh, On the, the flag. Siskan coming up. 
animation was already done, so it gets the 18 8 off there, but no STGs on these folks. Oh, gets the hit, and another 18 8 flag after that goes down. Oh. Good pick up. Shanked from many of angles there. That was just poor, poor play there for measurement. Left his uh, flag half track out to dry, really, there. And I think Kimbo could just push ahead here, not even have to bother with the T34. Could just go for the juggle and close out the game with T. Sorry, uh, not even bother with the T70. Enemy flanking us. What do you reckon? Three Katushas? <laughs> Three Katushas <laughs> into the base. <laughs> <laughs> no, get, get two M5s, half tracks, load up the boys, and drive in. <laughs> oh, yeah. You can do it in any base except the, the, the OKW because of the flak emplacements. Yeah, get like six, six uh, flame NGs, get ready to demo, <laughs> and then. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and then a few half tracks. Yeah, now you're talking. Next level strats for next level uh, timings. But yeah, I just oh, think oh, these oh, STGs are a nah, big mess. I don't think you can finish the demo in time here. Yeah, nice try. <laughs> GG. <laughs> the old BM demo. This map is like a lot of potential for cheeky demos, especially behind the little the hedge side blockers. Yeah. Right on the corners because they they seem to be the retreat path back from the mid VP near the dead horse. You could get a cheeky demo just north of there, I think, on the corner. Yeah. Enemy forces capturing supply sector. Second flag after coming up. Kimbo coming with an MX in on the turn. Kimbo is just keeping his uh, engineer on the field. So it's not in yeah, base no. building structures. Definitely been rewarded for, for opting with Soviets. I don't think any other faction would have this kind of uh, cheap and efficiency trades, especially wiping a stern pile with like cons and stuff. That yeah. that was a huge mismatch and big big turning point for this game. But it's going to be a second flag after this. This has got a call for T34s now. Surely. Don't bother with that, these and enemies. The Siskin is forced all the way back to base, so the flag half has a lot of room to maneuver. Ejimin knows where the positioning is. Yeah, no second part. He, he lost a combat engineer, did Kimbo, so he doesn't have that fast teching time, and we don't even see a tier 3 building up at the moment. This is a bit of a mistake. Could have had a T-34 out by now. Indeed. Or at least well on the way to um, producing and it. How much fuel is it again? 85 and... Yeah, but I guess he's got to do the tier 3 building as well, so... Yeah, yeah tier 3 is 85. Yeah, and then 90, and then... Yeah, 90. He's close, but not there yet. No. I guess, uh... Hageman did, did uh, manage to stop that dub fuel, so... It's just down to single at the moment. He's getting his, uh, half track. Should be able to get to Schwer soon. It's going to take quite a while though to upgrade it. The enemy is taking what we have secured. Yeah, I can uh, get the Schwer up, but not the, the Panzer authorization anytime soon, yeah? That needs another 60. <laughs> it's always so awkward, isn't it? Like uh, little light tanks driving past you. Yeah. Your Panzer Schwer and it's not authorized. It's like, God, come on, man. But this huge gun, this but it's just the two models that need to be. Uh, do, do you think that was a good change like just chop chopping the cost in half do you think it's changed much um well it what was to, to get the uh, robots out a little bit faster right but in return the robots can't get any upgrades yeah so kind of like relying on i only get the robots after i get the Panzer authorization so i don't know if the intended thing has mm. happened yeah was that their sneaky ploy to delay overs all along <laughs> Just let them come out with toothpicks and a bit of pineapple rather than a, an actual gun a gun that can do damage. But yeah, it is going to be the T70, so... Hmm. Yeah, interesting choice. I am that not old on board 13 with this minute choice. T70 when you're pretty far ahead, I would have thought. But... Yeah, I would have gone for the tank here. But is he ahead? Has the mist been, or the wool been pulled over our eyes, Stoney, in there? Completely misreading Asian's dominance. <laughs> Maybe. Well, the flag after definitely has got some little map control back for Asian. Yeah. That's why and, uh, I just think it's a it's a bad choice here going for the 17. 
and it's the rejuvenated well, second flag half, flag half once turn again. model, but it does not matter. I'm not sure it's going to die needed. like its predecessor. Yeah, Ooh. and down it goes. That's a big oof. That's two misplacements now of this flag yeah. half track. We see there, folks. Well, I don't know if. Meantime, Fox on the right hand side also being chased by the T70. Oh, yeah. Set defines value against the Fox. But the mistake there is, is not just the positioning, but also there's no infantry around it to cover yeah. or to spot. And uh, just didn't see the, the the conscripts there until too late and already was snared. Just like Asian is feeling the fatigue here. Yeah. Where his positioning like is. Uh, million AM for there. Not like. Normal situations, but at the moment he's just lacking a bit. Proving everyone is still human. But uh, nearly picks up the Vet 3 Flamer. That would have been a big loss for Kimbo there. <laughs> Instead, uh, resorts back to the old Ziz Barrage. When in doubt, 35 Munis are doubt. Does get to snare the T70, so it won't be able to chase on this retreat path. That was huge, because otherwise it's definitely dead. Yeah, but they're going to be able to they're sneak away. Way. Double down that are kitten right now. But I think the, the, the anti infantry power of Asian men is just gone with losing. Losing their flak. Losing yeah. their folks. The one thing uh, about this map that I love is the green cover is not on any of like the main VP points or too close to them, you know? And especially with the fuel, etc. You, you have to commit and you have to build your cover, your green cover here. So. Uh, that's why I think OKW and and Soviets are definitely good factions for this map. Another flag after coming up. Third time's the charm. Third time is the charm. We'll see. No authorization. Uh, for, I I don't know. Maybe this is just like you know what. <laughs> yeah, actually, maybe Kimbo maybe moved. a bit of giving yeah. up from Asia in here. I don't know. Nah, he's going for the full on turtle strat. <laughs> Only way he's gonna get back into the game. Kimbo yeah, doing stupid stuff, but I don't often see Kimbo doing stupid stuff. Objective secured. But authorization though is almost like a flag after a bit safer. <laughs> so I don't know. Well, well, the third in line to the throne. Two fifty one seventeen flag after. It's gonna be um, it's gonna be hard pushed against. Basically, it could be. Tier 4 coming out now. Yep, being built. Nearly finished up for Kimbo. So we're going to see T34s against Flak Half Tracks. It was a good one. Yeah, Tier 4 is down, and there's plenty of fuel and manpower in the bank to start cracking on a vehicle. T3476 in the build. Triple cap is on. Benjamin feeling the pain right now. Mm. It's pretty amazing, though, how he's somehow managed the. Uh, VPs this well, <laughs> considering you've lost two flak half jacks, you're about to lose a third, <laughs> and, and you're still only down like 70 VPs or so. Yeah, this guy moving up, recon mode acquired by the T70 light tank. Oh, yeah, Kimbo sees everything that's going on. Oh, nice, nice mine. Could be the Set play, yeah. the old bait and shake. No. Oh, second weekend's there. Flak half tracks there. Yeah, I got this. Flak half track gets it. Another oh, I nearly thought that'd be an abandon, but then remember the Tony mode. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it like the abandon. Yeah, like exactly. <laughs> You're like, oh, I know. Like, oh. <laughs> this might just be enough to get back into the game a little bit. Yeah, Kimbo going for a second at Tegan. Oh, okay, a misread. Flex. Yeah. Doesn't like counting fuel, I guess, the opponent. The sissies, he says. I mean, uh, let's uh, 150 in flak half tracks. So. Yeah. You just. A bit of a misread, maybe, I don't know. Tide is kicking in equal front, so they're both in the same war, you know. And a bit of an early retreat there from Asia, then doesn't finish capping the fuel. <laughs> Look at that. Finally, the incendiary detonates Whoa. the mine, gets the engine crit off on the T3476. <laughs> and wipe like a billion mo Yeah. Yeah. That was the perfect nade. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, never stand on top of your own mine. <laughs> Especially not when there's <laughs> flames on top of it. <laughs> oh my god. A lot of dead bodies in that in that exact area. <laughs> Do you think 
crawlers. Okay, we're gonna be real stickler here. Do you think crawlers are like mega lols, R and Jesus shouldn't be in tourney mode? If that can ever be turned off, because they give um, you free vision without you. Yeah, but they should be because there are all uh, Ostia also has abilities to use the crawlers, so you can't get them off. You have to interrogate the ability with uh, the G43s upgrade on the Grenadiers, and then you literally see everything on the map. Mm. Yeah, fair enough. Alright, alright. And I like, uh, back to the game, I like um, Kimbo's just constant harassment on the east for the fuel. It's a long way to have to go, but... B-34 coming in for the pounds on the flag off track. Panzer Swear has been authorized though. As uh, Kimbo moves backwards, a key tins line up, both shots connect. That T-34 is out of action for a little bit. Yeah, luckily that three um, combat engineers will fix, fix you hella fast. They've got 10 kills. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the flame war engineers from Soviets this, uh, this day Such have... Such a power uh, spike, isn't it? Yeah. Ooh, what oh, what a double wreck there! Let's watch that again! Huge oh. shot goes in for Kimbo. Yeah. Oh, against Kimbo. Asia men being ready. Boom, and they hit it at the same time as well. Not a millisecond. Synchronized cadence, folks. Yeah, not they're, a millisecond to... to they're to... joining a Olympic swimming synchronized team next week, but wow. Wow. Oh, Whilst they're sure. here, they thought they'd double bang that T-34. Both penned as well. Big oof there from yeah. uh, Kimbo. So he's lost his T-70 to a kind of a bit of an all-in YOLO charge, and then just... I think that was just straight up negligence with the T-34 loss. Yeah, it's just like a little bit of a throw here. Yeah, Still has a huge well by, um, Asian, And suddenly the third half track seems like a brilliant idea. <laughs> <laughs> and suddenly <laughs> double Siskin yeah. also seems like a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, suddenly like the big brains are being uh... I'm gonna do stupid stuff. <laughs> Let me get a Siskin <laughs> before I do stupid stuff. <laughs> yeah, three head commentators, dude. These guys are operating on a... Uh, different um, echelon of uh, mind games but um yeah the the sweepers are up again and pushing forward for asia mint he's definitely got the wind in the Ooh, sails fox going to deal goes down conspiracy pick off a fox ah, the that was a bit of a that's a bit of a stinger in his momentum there could have done without that definitely asia but he's going to go for second over Enemy so the commitment to the sector. late game is strong from this one Oh, this is my pump action, this power is a joke. You're, you're, you're <laughs> trying to get close to up, me. <laughs> quickly yeah. loading a different shell and then straight away, like, plum, plum. <laughs> and, and giving it that perfect, like, bending arc. I don't know how yeah. they somehow arc their shots when it's a barrage <laughs> as opposed to. <laughs> it's pretty funny, like, a tiny range. I think they actually launched them with balloons. And okay. Then yeah. At the top. They lose the balloon and then it drops down again. So, got a little arc. E yeah. Expert usage of helium on the battlefield. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing goes to waste with these uh, these um, Soviet boys. T-34 ready for combat. Three man max. Now, now we're looking uh, like, do you even bother with a P4? Or do you just go full late game committal King Tiger here if you're Asian man? <laughs> <laughs> Could well, do it, right? I mean, he's... It's I would three, definitely get three, him uh, uh, the chat price. Yeah. Hello, Oof! And a oh. double hit back straight. Siskins. Yeet the flag half track into a different planet. And look at all the wrecks. They all die in like the same area as well. Now that's a lot of five fuels. <laughs> <laughs> you can Needs get to some uh, hold up. But um, wow. I didn't know these guys were Call of Duty players with double tap perk because <laughs> their AT guns are working in perfect <laughs> unison. The they got a Kimbo I mean, what equipped. Do you, do? you can't, you can't avoid that if both AT guns set up at that exact time. But bang, you're out of there. Eat and kill. Asian men being forced off the field now. Time for Kimbo to get back on there. He's a and little bit slow. And the mighty seven-man cons hold against Ubers. I mean, yeah, you're going to be losing a lot of models. As long as there's heavy cover, might yeah. be possible. Yeah, saddest day of your life when your your first Uber model gets sniped and then you just sat there on three, just 
somewhat having a little migraine of whether you should keep him out or send him home again. <laughs> Whereas the cons are like, yeah, we got models for days, but we'll be fine. Oh, good. Oh, T-34 getting a couple of smacks on the schnars from these Rakedans. But yeah, three wrecks, like he's saying, all within the same screen. You can see them all. But yeah. um, do you even suck them up or do you use that uh, cover? I mean, even yeah. sucking them up just it takes time. It takes micro. Uh, you don't have the manpower at the moment to get anything else anyway. So it's also the easiest way to get debated into losing one of your squads. I find. Yeah. <laughs> the amount of times my vet five vampires has been <laughs> thrown away to, to five fuel. Like, oh, God damn! Why is it so tough? They they always clump up as well. Like so, perfect target yeah. for that Ziskun barrage. And they get that received like damage thing because they're technically building or whatever. Oh get painful but finally triple 150 uh, fuel oh my god I've seen it for the P4. first time in my life Ober ran over a oh, oh goes down. Line and didn't die but then it dies to its own Rakedon GG was that the Rakedon? what was that? Yeah, the, the Rakedon shot the sandbag Detonated a mine and the mine was right next to Sam. Oh my! I, yeah. Okay. It's 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 a it's a little one technique how to give an MG34 to your vampires. Never mind. Never mind. We're fine, folks. We're fine. Asian men. It's all all calculated. All intended. Oh, big push here though from Asian men. Double rack P4 coming up. Infantry to support. He's uh. Resistance. A little bit in trouble. Need to run. But that's a code 2 first for me. Yes. I saw the Obers run over a tripwire mine. It's it activated the sound, but they didn't lose a model. And it didn't activate the vision. That was weird. <laughs> I don't know if anyone clipped that moment, but that would have been a good moment X to clip. Just X to X-File so stuff going on here. <laughs> see what really happened there. <laughs> we need Mold and Scully on the case. But uh yeah, this this Looks a bit anemic forces now for Asian, especially with Poops on the ground. He's going to go with an MG34 to kind of dig in, but only having two Volks, that's oh, even the danger zone there. I'm in trouble, eating a couple of Keaton shots, three connect, B4 can't uh, Three head chase. in with the P4, no? Mm, doesn't. Oh, <laughs> western flank Enemy says otherwise, yeah. I don't think I've ever seen a Storm Pioneer with an MG34, have you? Ah, oh, every day, mate. <laughs> if, I, if, I, if I see... Because normally all your Volks are taken up, their weapon slots. So if I see any kind of gun, I don't care what it is. I'm just like a little magpie to something shiny, you know? I see a drop gun, I'm picking it up, I don't uh, care. PTRS, yeah, give me, give me, give me. <laughs> I mean, I've had them plenty of times with the double bars when I'm fighting USF, but... Never yeah. picked up my own MG34. I, I don't know if you got the saying in Dutch, but in England, like, it says stolen fruit always tastes better. <laughs> it's like that with. Uh, Ooh, Hakita goes weapons. down. Gonna get uh, killed here by the AT guns, it seems. Hope is bravely marching yeah. out to T34 fire and conscripts. Oh, but they the can't help are missing the all the shots. And the P34 needs to finish the job. Siskins once the again with fast speed mode for P4 now gets a bit one. But I yeah. Uh, do you like the side with swag run of the Obers? <laughs> Bundle goes in. They look so funny. Ooh, Maxim looking low uh, on the other side. The Volks going to goes down to the T34. Maxim might go down in the center. Both yep. people losing squads. Maxim does go down. Siskins line up in the back, and they. Connect on the P4. Is T34 going in for the kill? It's not. It's holding back. But P4 on the right for the flank and Shank in the rear. Kills the T34. Kill. Great play there by Kimbo. And Asia Mint drops. Oh, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> awesome finish. Absolutely <laughs> insane. We are going up for the Ace game. Yikes. Going all the way, Stanley, just for you and your voice. <laughs> the ultimate test of commentating, having done about eight games in a row.
Well played to both players. Nice yeah. uh, surround and pound there from Kimbo at the end. But Asia mid seemed to, to be slipping and losing the micro battles across all, all aspects of the of the map at the end there. So that's got to give a huge confidence boost for Kimbo. 